Arizona eliminated. Meanwhile, Catalina Foothills High School is the number one seed in baseball at the 5A level and a win for the Falcons tonight against Horizon will allow Catalina Foothills to advance to the state championship on Tuesday against number two seed Castile. The Falcons lost to Horizon earlier in the playoffs, then beat Horizon yesterday. And since this double elimination, Horizon wasn't knocked out of the tourney at that point. So now that both teams have a loss, tonight's matchup was for all the marbles. News for Tucson's David Kelly. He was in the Phoenix area getting all the action. And I got a question for everybody. What's your favorite baseballism? I believe Foothills coach Lance Roberson is telling his catcher that his is to gun out runners to second base. And how about Falcon sophomore Luke Pollock going the opposite way with the bases loaded. Braden Franz and Dana White score for the Foothills team, Catalina Foothills. And then the Huskies commit their third error of the game. You saw it throwing the ball away. That allows Matt Adams to come all the way and slide home. It'll be 8-3 Catalina Foothills. And then the ninth grader Payton Good on the mound and Payton was making a pay. Really good. Getting out of the jam. Meanwhile, Matt Adams, the senior for Catalina Foothills, will be closing it out with the 8-5 victory. Catalina Foothills will now play Castile on Tuesday night, looking to win its first state championship. The playoffs continue tonight for a number of Tucson area teams and one squad that got a home game and doesn't have to suit up in the Phoenix area like the other Tucson area baseball squads is South Point Catholic. The Lancers are the number one seed in the 4A playoffs and win this evening against Paradise Honors and they'd punch their ticket to the state championship game.